Friday. Friday. Delivery done. Delivery done. <laughs> In Colorado. Oh, yep. Yeah. Just outside of Denver. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. I forget what the city name. That went smooth. Was. Oh, and you when you got there this morning, there was a, a Landstar tractor trailer. Yeah, that's very nice. There too. Yeah, we both. He was there last night. We got there like an hour and a half early, and him and me stood outside. He. It's funny. They got their new. They had a new truck too. They were tractor trailer drivers, but they got a new truck too, and they got theirs. Right about the same time we got ours, and beautiful truck. They yeah. had a was it a Western Western Star, Star 168 inch sleeper. Yeah, huge. One of those beautiful. ones with the side door on the <laughs> over there. They had uh, two cute little doggies. Yeah, 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 yeah. Really cool meeting meeting them, but yeah, man. So we are dead heading now. We are on the I seventy six, still in Colorado. Yeah, yeah. heading to, to South Dakota. Yeah. We'll give that much away, I yeah. guess. <laughs> we won't pick up till the next vlog because it doesn't pick up till Monday. Monday, but, but where, where, where is it in like Sioux Falls? Sioux Falls, I think yeah. we're going to go check out the falls. Yeah, on Google Maps, that looks really pretty. So yeah, yeah. if it's open, I, don't, I mean, it looked like it was open. Google didn't say it was closed. So yeah, yeah. we're going to probably, it's about 650 mile deadhead. So we're probably going to do half today, half tomorrow. I only got an hour left. Yeah, we'll probably switch to my time now and... Let me take a nap. Sure. Take a little nap. A little siesta. Yeah. <laughs> we got some projects to do this weekend. We do. Um, our air conditioner... I know it's going to sound like we have more problems. <laughs> <laughs> the bunk air conditioner, not the, the rooftop. The, when, yeah, the yeah. air conditioner when we're driving down the road. Yeah, it's runs a separate the, HVAC unit. Yeah. It runs off of the HVAC unit of the truck when the truck's running. So that's what you use when you're back there. Um, it just doesn't blow that great. Yeah. It's not blowing. And when we were with uh, Patrick last week... Uh, checking out some of his new trucks that he was getting ready for new drivers, which has the same HVAC system as we have, just from a different uh, builder, it blew a lot better. Yeah. So we, we did look at it last week and I don't know, the air ducting seems it could be better. Yeah. Well, one part of it, it like it goes, the HVAC system is on this side under the bench seat. Yeah. And um, it goes, the tubing, it goes, there's four vents back there with it, two up top, two down at the bottom. And the side that comes over here, there's actually a, a little bit of a raised lip down under the bed in the back where like part of the water tank is and some of the like water pump and stuff. Yeah. And the part of the ducting was on top of that. And then there's a plywood um, yeah. panel that you can raise up and stuff to get in access. And it was squishing it. It was so squishing it. Plus, that. like what they did is there's four vents coming off the HVAC unit. Then uh, they take two hoses and did like a together <laughs> and then a tube coming off of that. But I mean, the way it goes, it goes like this and, and then, then the air has to be pushed up. Well, that collision of air is drastically reducing airflow. If I mean, if anything, it should be like that. So the airflow just goes up together, but it, instead it's coming like this and being forced up yeah. through the vent. I, I'm going to do a video on it. We <laughs> yeah. stopped by Home Depot today and I picked up some uh, three inch dryer vent. Yeah. I, I got like a big long 25 foot bit and I'm going to look at different options. Continue on Central Avenue. I may cap off two of the vents on the HVAC system and just run the, two, the two to the the vents we use yeah because two of them are under the bed and of course we have stuff under there so Laundry. we have those vents closed yeah, off yeah, anyway yeah. we're giving too much away we're gonna do a whole <laughs> video on it <laughs> we'll, we'll show it all in a video but this is a great tip for any hvac system in any truck because out of the four trucks we've been in so far in expediting Every single truck has had some wonky venting Ducting. system. They use like way too much. And then when it's connected, then it's all scrunched in and doing like a little snake. Yeah, which drastically reduces, reduces, airflow. Airflow. It reduces airflow. It reduces airflow drastically. So, um, but we'll show you like ours has that a little bit back there and yeah. hopefully we can get it better. Cause yesterday, like we're, 
like when we've been in hot weather, it's been hot back there. Yeah, it is. You warm can't back get there. comfortable, and it, and I'm the one that's sleeping during the day most of the time, and during the heat of the day, fat boy's got to yeah. got to be cold. I need it cold <laughs> when I'm sleeping. Yeah, so it's hopefully it'll be just an easy fix. Nothing's easy. major wrong with it. We just yeah, yeah, no, yeah, just no. reroute the ducting. Just, and, just poor ducting work, I think. Yeah, but the babies are back there chewing on. I gave them some little chew bone sticks that they like, and they're both back there chomping on them. But we're about to let, let them O U T. Let them out of this little grass area. <laughs> so we've we've come to the conclusion because usually what we do when we stop and before we do a clip we'd let them out, but then they'd always be bugging for treats, even though they got treats after they went out. Yeah. So now we've realized that we do the clips first and then let them O U T. Then let them out. No. So they're not bugging for treats while we're trying to, yeah, <laughs> to do right, a clip. Because right. the treats we give them is never enough. They of always want not. more. No, especially Tyson. Yeah. yeah. He, He's the whiner for treats. He will treats. whine until you just absolutely don't give them no more. Abby's annoying feature is she barks at everything. And Tyson's <laughs> annoying feature is he whines when he wants something. <laughs> yeah. Which is good because, you yeah. know, he like he stays back on the bed most all day when we're driving. If and if he needs to go potty or needs a drink or is hungry, he'll whine and let let us know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not like a whining whining, no, but, but like. No, just like, you know, that, yeah, that yeah, noise. Yeah, yeah, They'll yeah. let you know they need something. But, yeah, and Abby yeah. will do that too, but. Yeah. Yeah, so. Well, we're rambling, so let's uh, let on. them out and get on this deadhead and come with us on our trip to South Dakota. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Is, is that a Vanna White, like. <laughs> Shaved his head, looks good. Oh, I did, yeah. <laughs> Happy Saturday. From Sioux Falls, South Dakota. We've been wanting to come check this place out a couple oh, times, yes. but we never had time. This is so. Falls Park here in I, Sioux Falls. I think the last time we were here was winter time. I think it was, yeah. <laughs> we actually, uh, we went ahead and drove straight up here after we delivered in Colorado yesterday. Yeah. Decided just to go ahead and get here. Jason laid down, I got us most of the way. And yeah, yeah. Got here late last night, but oh my gosh, it's so beautiful here. It is so nice, yeah. We're gonna go walking around and exploring, so yeah. we'll see. I'm glad it cleared up, because this morning it was raining, and I was like, oh man, is it gonna be raining all day today and tomorrow? Yeah, and yeah. It is supposed to rain tomorrow, so I'm glad it cleared up this afternoon. We took an Uber over here. What was it, like eight miles from the truck stop? We're staying at the Flying J in Sioux Falls. Yeah, we actually paid for a reserve parking there, too. Yeah. We don't have to run the generator. No, it's nice. It's I mean, nice weather. It's, it's so. warming up right now, but. A little bit right now. Not bad. But yeah. When the sun goes behind the clouds, it's perfect. But, oh my gosh. I just, I just can't stop looking at it. It's so beautiful. <laughs> I love doing stuff like this. Yeah. It's just beautiful. I mean, and this is something free. You don't have to pay to do it. To see yeah, some beautiful scenery. That, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And we're going to go uh, eat dinner after this. Found a steakhouse here in downtown. We're going to go try called Min Minerva's or? Minerva's. You get in on Minerva's. <laughs> That's what I do to him. I yeah. always get on his nerves. <laughs> <laughs> we'll post the name up here. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I think it's like Minerva's or something. Yeah, it but... looked really good online. And, yeah. and our Uber driver said it was a really good place. Yeah, so. we're going to walk around here. we got a bunch of plans to uh, projects we're going to do tomorrow. Yeah. That air conditioner vent. We're going to try to improve that. So we'll, yeah. we'll see how that goes. Yeah. All right. So let's go take a look around. Cool.
Monday, y'all, and happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day. Already passed, I know, when you're saying yeah, this, but yeah, I hope yeah. you dads out there had a wonderful Father's Day. Yeah. Whether you're dads to humans or fur babies, <laughs> this guy's a fur baby dad. Yeah. <laughs> so we haven't done any projects that we were going to do today. We so. have it, but we had an awesome time yesterday. We did. We did. We got to go have dinner at a really nice oh, restaurant. It was really good. Minerva's. Yeah, it, was it was really good. good. Um, it was cheap too. It was, yeah. Yeah, I was thinking we were gonna walk out of there two hundred dollars, and it wasn't. So no, and yeah, it was we, really nice. We uh, after we were walking around the falls, we were gonna get a lift, and we seen a trolley car there. Yeah. And Jason, he's he's like, well, let me go out, see how much it is, or if we can ride it. Yeah. And they gave us a ride down to the restaurant for it, free. It we was free. We gave him a tip because he was doing like uh, some historical like talk, a, talking about the history of Sioux Falls, and, and yeah, 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 it was really. Cool. Downtown was beautiful too. It's a popping downtown. There was like people <laughs> rolling in fancy cars and hot rodding and yeah, it was pretty cool. Beautiful, yeah. beautiful area. And man, I'm so bummed because we were gonna take the drone and get some drone footage. There's an airport. Yeah, we can't even get a drone flight here at the truck stop because yep. we're so close to the airport. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because there was a beautiful sunset last night. Yeah, was. Oh my gosh, it would have been a beautiful flight, but. Well, I, ho I hope you guys enjoyed the, the scenery stuff we got with that one. Uh, I thought it was beautiful. I know, I love when yeah. we get to do that kind of stuff. And we busted out all the good cameras and gimbals and yeah, it was pretty awesome. Yeah, very good. So we're going to end this one here. We pick up our next load tomorrow, so you'll see that in the next vlog. Thank you guys, as always, for watching and subscribing. Until our next video. Peace, love, and expediting.